typically all about fall right now, but a local nonprofit that collects gifts for kids for Christmas is starting things a little earlier this year. That's right. Tending your size, Ian Vedaneshi spoke with the founder of Christmas Sponsorship 757 about why they are starting to accept applications a few weeks earlier. Like everyone starts early at Christmas time, it seems. Right. Well, the founder says every year the need continues to grow, and they say this year they're expecting to help thousands of children. Four years ago, when Savannah Avery started Christmas Sponsorship 757, she didn't know just how many people in Hampton Roads would reach out for help. Her organization provides Christmas gifts to kids across the area. And the need for her organization quickly grew from serving around 100 kids to serving more than 1,400 kids last year. And this year we're expecting to double that number. And because the number of kids in need is expected to be in the thousands this year, her organization started things a little earlier. They've already begun collecting um, toys and, and gifts. Here we have the kids, so six to nine. We have the most toys in this area. And this year, the they're adding food. Drink. At the end of the last season, we did a survey with all of our members, like how can we do better? What did you like? What didn't you like? And we really listened to their feedback. We changed a few things, and food was one of the biggest things that, because the kids were getting gifts, but then they were hungry. The founder also tells me they're opening the application process for families a few weeks earlier this year. We're starting to take applications on October 10th. Um, and they just joined the group, Christmas Sponsorship 757. The night before the 10th, we'll post the application. They'll fill out the answers and send it to our page via Facebook message. They serve kids all the way up to age 18, and will also serve those over the age of 18 who have special needs. Christmas is a really magical time in a kid's life, and we want to make sure that every kid in Hampton Roads can experience that. Avery says they have an Amazon wish list, accept cash donations, and will also be looking for people to sign up and be a sponsor. Avery says they'll start taking sponsors October 20th. Sponsors will fill out a form with how many kids they want to help in the city they can do it in. If you want more information about how you can help, just head over to wavy.com. Deanna Betaneshi, 10 on your side.